before imagine They, where we start your weekend on a weekday, as you can see on my right, one very handsome, very, very handsome DJ, Ati Rajita Gadget. Benitez. Benitez, I'm a mock and a new year. you come on the notice? I don't know if we are allowed to zoom. Kuna <laughs> earrings missing now. Makose me fanyika, guys. And the makosa ni yangu. But that is fine. My name is Valentine or at Color Me Val on everything. And we have something so very, very special for you. But before that, Benitez, so now you are to transfer time your form. True, true. Uh -huh. yeah. So, Leo, for yeah. example, yeah. my neo kama za usiku siku like this, utakuwa wapi? Utakuwa kavali. Uh -huh. Kavali at the mana every Friday uh -huh. and Saturday. Uh -huh. Yeah, in Queensland. Okay. Na, na Sunday, tuna rest ama? Yeah, Sunday pia, maybe kakuna form, tutapanga. Tuna, okay, so just basically tukufuate kwa mtandao. Tunakupata aji? Uh, Benitez underscore KE. Uh -huh. Kwa IG. All right. Yeah. Hey. Sikuizi umeomoka. Kuna mahali ni patara na Benitez. Alikuwa na ingiza mashilingi. Na bado janibaye ya blanjo. Ni sawa? After this. Oh, ni sawa. Ok. Ju, nikuwa ni yaribu. Ilikuwa ni seme. Ni sitome. Ni sitome? Ni sitome. Ndambe ya kuta. Although kutame ni crop kwa picha leo, sijajamu. By the way, sija jam ni sawa. Hashtag is social Friday. At Y54 on Facebook. By the way, Y54 underscore channel on the gram. Y54 channel on X. Haha, tume toksima Twitter. Ding. And of course, TikTok and them and threads. There's threads. Anyway, so in studio with us, very handsome gentleman and Mona already mshan toksima. Aki, the love I have for lots guy. I'll try to. Utafanya sike ni disemba na ndo tuko January katikat. Adi umaza kujianga. Ebo tunaza mpigia kelele shuwa li. Tumkaribisha vizuri DJ. Ah, no. Utachotwa, by the way. Utachotwa. Yeah, that's how we do it over here. And what's your good name? Thank you. Night to work with you. My name is Collins. Social media, Kulu Blue. Wagwan. Vee, nakuwana wako mtandao bano umetulia sana, uko sawa? Nakuwana ni metulia hivi. Wala. Iyo ni karakta. Oh. Eee, unajokiwa uko lazima. Aha. Eee, siyate uhuhuwezi tuko home. Sasa, why with the violets? This is my size, I can tell. Violets all over. Alright, Kulu. Yeah. Okay, clearly you're famous. Kwanza tuwanza na mtandao yako, just in case there's someone out there who doesn't really know who you are, how they can find you as... Talk you mpola mpola as we be talking. My name is Kolo Blue uh -huh. on all social media platforms. Uh -huh. uh, Instagram, TikTok, Twitter, Threads, uh -huh. na YouTube. Uh -huh. Kuna ingine? Uh, na Facebook, eh, yeah, na Facebook. Baba, Facebook. Yeah, yes, yeah, definitely. Uh, Facebook ni koko na funza gawa toto kudance. Uh -huh. So lazima ni yonge na wazazi wawo, one, two, one, two. Wow. Uh, na wengi wawo. Wako Facebook. I have so many questions, but let's start with the things that you have introduced uh -huh. to the conversation. Why color blue? Why blue? Um, blue is my favorite color. Uh -huh. But then my first ex back in high school. Where? Ni Where? 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 Identify, so I felt blue is everything that I am. Mm -hmm. So, not wearing a shade of blue as we speak, but Ms. no, it's in, in a quaga to Namimi. Yeah, eh, yeah. Danny, inside. Mm. Come over here, what yeah. Mm -hmm. Hey, yeah, but it is not easy to know. urban. Eh? Yeah, my yeah, books and books. Okay, mm. all right. Okay, so mm. about the children. So, how did this start? Why dance? Yeah. Maze. Wala. Uh, dance, dance will come to. I am not. I am not a talented dancer. Talk I'm not a born talented dancer. Uh -huh. Yeah, I sing talent wise. Z like talent wise. Say you don't know scanning And don't check out YouTube. Eh, playing back a car hobby, but so sorry. Kwanza kwanza usani direction ya mziki kaka very steep. So to say, the Kenyan music industry is not easy to get to. Yeah, so dancing was was near what I was doing at the time, and then it okay you. So first year people are dancing, so my environment is just full of dancers. So ni kenge ni juu wenye kunenda, got to learn in a few years. Eight years down the line, kwa mang 
good dancers in Kenya. Uh -huh. yeah, oh, I'm not a born. Oh, I'm a good dancer. Mm. And you have the courage, the audacity. What when you are not a funny thing, your talent small in a miss. Mm -hmm. yes. When you are a little bit of a thing, you are a little bit of a thing. So, again, with the children, so it was hey, it a so COVID idea? Back in the days, sasa, after I was dance, I was like, 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 I needed to make money off dance. Mm -hmm. So, the only way I would make money off dance was through teaching after I became good at it. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and then. I, pre I am really easy going with kids. Me prefer our total compared to adults any time. We're difficult. Definitely. But me see adults, and I'm, I'm still children. Oh, uh -huh. so we can work with you. Then it doesn't talk Eh, so we have been our total. We can vibe to our toy. Then got a few gigs of working our toy. Then I realized I got something. I would I was able to get to kids easier, faster. I was mm. able to teach kids in the context of dance, right? You see. Mm -hmm. Mm, so I opened my own dance class, which has now developed to a full-blown dance academy. Wow. Yeah, Tunakwanga. Every last holiday, we had like a full holiday package. Wow. But we work here at home. But so society, Tunafunza Saturn Sunday. Up at Fikaro Drosters, uh -huh. just next to Club Loft. Kuna Jimmy kwa apu apondo tume set up every Saturday 11 to 1 p.m. Tunafunza watoto peke yake. Only. Now, yeah. watoto age ni? Age is from four. To 14. 14. Yeah, because we do not, we have an, an adult dance class that's on Sunday, but mm -hmm. Sasami Spendi mix the two because of different things. Wait, one of the people who are going to be able to do it's true, his life. Mazen is showing you how to do it. I'm going to be able to do it. I'm going to be able to do it. I'm going to be I know, I know, but Lisa, Mali, I'm going Hey, so I was saying, um, mixing kids and adults for dance class, it was like a bit not very okay with me because I felt the kind of music that kids are receptive to, the context of the conversations that go on in a class, ya watu wakubwa, zenye watu wanava. Basically, different behavior uh -huh. that is presented by us okay. is not really favorable to kids. That even the kind of dancing you're doing for adults is not really, really um, what kids should be learning at a particular age. So I sought to find a, a specific class. Yawatoi and Itaku are friendly with the music, with the language, with everything that is happening around them. Uh -huh. Yeah. So, Nataka Sema dance class here to a Kubani on a song, a body parts in Guinea or total five songs. Ideally, come ni dance on a faku dance. When I get so, if I could leave me to a come to Kubua, you see, you see, move your 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 lower abdomen. Zuinini. English. That is, English. That is supposed to You're be. Your wife, my dear. Uh -huh. <laughs> that is supposed to be a free. Um, dancing is basically connecting to your soul. So if you feel like connecting to your soul is this part, then I shouldn't limit you because there are kids in class. Uh -huh. But then again, me being the coach, I'm supposed to also look at their um, your environment ni ni favorable ko So uh -huh. nika feel dance classes a Kenya zilikuwa zina mix the two na uh -huh. kwa I go okay, honestly. Mm. Uh, so nika feel pia. Even the kind of the context of the dance that we're doing, mm. unapata kuna technique flani ta kwa ngumu kwa mtoi. Mm. No mtoi ni talented dancer. Mm -hmm. So they needed to have like um curriculum yenye kwa set up step by step. Because mm -hmm. mimi ukineka dance class na mtoi, utakuwa ukiamua ufe ufunze vitu zenye ni favorable kwa mtoi, utakuwa ni underserve kama mm -hmm. your client. Mm -hmm. Na nikiamua nifunze vitu zenye ni favorable kwa mtu mkubwa, utakuwa mm -hmm. na underserve kwa mtoi ka client. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so that's why we did a split, mm -hmm. and it's 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 good. It's been two years now, mm -hmm. like a fully a fully developed dance class with kids and adults separate, and it's working. To not to our wingy way to work on social media. So you wanna film what I could like. This is how you do to me. TV. To me, I'm going to do the Kana. I'm going to brand endorsements. Nini nini, mm -hmm. which is the ultimate goal to make dance um um a means of earning a living. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mesquite and Sema, what to a Kenya, who are wanna mix, what to a Kenya, Yanni, others. 
Yeah, yes, ni kama. Sija sema watu wakiona. Kolo ta have had time na mimi. Ibitabu ni desire raka raka. Hashtag no social Friday. Right, so I hear apparently that a little bird told me that you are also a psychologist. Yep. By profession. So ni likuwa ke UA. Ok, ni kwa ke UA. Ulikuwa ke UA na watu walikuwa shakata. Mini mekuwa, ni mekuwa ke UA. Niko KU but I'm still a student. I graduated then went back for mm, to continue the same post. Yeah. Difficult. Difficult you? Zizi zizi. Nile. Um nilingia kiu nikianza ku dance nilijulia ku dance kiu first year my course takes five years so nikafanya counseling psychology i did the fifth year when i graduated then two years ago sasa nilikuwa graduate then now nikaingia job which i quit later on i have worked in a morgue wow yeah the plot thickens what do you mean definitely Focus. Do you have time? Eh, I do, I do by the way. Yeah. Tell me about Uli Jipataje kwa mog. Nili decide kwenda mog. Okay, ni watu wali kwa na kusumbo kwa natika kuongea na mtu. The mog environment is actually a good environment. Explain If you see it in a different way. Walk, yeah. walk me through that process. You get to appreciate life. Okay, okay. That I understand. Majawe daily ukitoka home, unakujoku. I realize kuna watu uko, wanatoka, wanapeleka watu wao on a daily. Wow. So mtu wako huko daily hata mekutua prayer mm-hmm. hata ki kuluzi mama ke, sister ke, baba ke, the boyfriend, the girlfriend because daily you see people taking their loved ones that direction you get. Mm-hmm. But personally why I went there is because I just felt like in my profession doing mm-hmm. counseling and therapy I felt like um, we have so many therapists out here doing addiction, doing marriage. Um, doing, we're talking about. When you oh, want us to do your mother, I'm a boy. I don't know. I'm a cute together. Yeah. 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 Yeah the weight it carries. I get it. Losing a, a, a significant person in a quagga crazy. I always understand kama how you lose. So Mimi, at some point in my life, earlier before I got to high school, I got to experience such a thing with my mom. She lost someone. And how I saw her change because of lacking therapy now, which I understand now, made me want to never see another son, see their mom in my lenses, yeah. So nika feel neza occupy your space ndo ule mse mwenye na lose a significant other anapata mse wa kumsupport kwa hiyo journey at the time. So that's why I decided to work in the MOOC for a year and seven months after. Nika kuangu muju ya history ya usani. Eh, sasa nika have to drop kidogo but nitarudi tu. Have you ever been in the space to counsel others like a practitioner? To counsel? Others. Yeah, I have worked for an year and seven months. No, MOOC. Lakini face to face like ku cancel. Kwa ni mog me cancel lad. Okay, okay. That's a good question. Mog me cancel kwa ni me leta awa tu ama wapi. Oh, 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 if you have lost someone and you've come maybe for post-mortem, Nini. Identifies identifying you. when you're coming for burial, That's when you're coming thing. to view. Yeah, there are some particular morgues, very few morgues. Nilikuwa Kenyatta University Funeral Home. That is among the few, t- maybe three, that have counselors, like uh-huh. a full team of counselors. Uh-huh. Yeah. I hear a counselor needs also a counselor. Yeah, you, 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 you get. It's a team where... Well, Uki, ukifika yo point ya uh, inaitwa burnout mm-hmm. unaezongelesha mtu when you feel but for me it, it empowered me on a daily uh-huh. na appreciating life na see as take life for granted which is normal like unajua usipo kama hauko kwa hiyo kwa hiyo kwa hiyo um, experience ya watu kulose 
honestly we tend to forget we are so busy huko in Nairobi umeenda archives umekuja hapa umehost kutoka hapa sio juende meeting wapi hiyo siku kuna mtu kwani unanijua eh sasa ndio nasema hiyo siku kuna hiyo siku kuna mtu ame ame haja hajaweza kupata usingizi yesterday night because alikuwa anaenda kuzika babake leo you get but because you have not experienced that so you, we are kind of not really even remembering about it until it hits but now those people need people to take care of them at a particular time so okay. yani yeah, occupy your space na tunaendelea na your space we have opened a company yeah therapy or we will open with a friend of mine you guys know her nasiku nasiku is a psychologist too mm-hmm. she's a therapist so we want to work on helping people undergoing loss to be able to navigate the loss easier eh na tumtu tunaangalia ngatu mental health let's take care of our mental health but hakuna mtu anakuwa garedi kuongelelea how much loss gets your mental health uko chini mm-hmm. so sasa sisi tuko hapo ku, kusaidia watu your space kusaidiana sasa juu umekuwa honest sana hata mimi nikuwa honest kidogo. Kuwa honest. Ndio. Be with me. Ah, you should see your face. <laughs> you see your face. Okay, so hata mimi nime experience Carlos Plani. Mhm. Hiyo inaye ni ilini ushapigwa butani kama kupigwa when I was in primary school we used to have a star alikuwa aitwa Mr. Jumba. Mr. Jumba kwa tunda math. I think mwalimu wa math alitoka hapo juu yake. Mm. Cuz huyo mwali eh. Mm-hmm. Yaani alikuwa anakupiga bare una feel. Alafu nini masikio unasikia ti <laughs> well, you, like he was that powerful the yeah. slap so even don't wanna scare when you pity your loss but it took me a couple of years until me realize yeah, by the way I need help i really do need help na function yeah. too but i am not okay mm. so how how can you tell unaona mtu hayuko sawa kama vile sasa hakuna mtu anakuwa sawa you cannot go through loss and be okay mm-hmm. by not being okay doesn't mean you're sick mm-hmm. that's what people need to understand you mm-hmm. get because i think one thing that we need to actually do so that we can protect our mental health in kenya ni to achieve stigma ya tukisema mtu ako na shida ya kichwa tuna assume amechizi mm. mtu amechizi ni psychotic that's an illness yeah hey, that's an illness mm. but all of us may have psychological illnesses mm-hmm. that are besides psychotism una siza white hey, like z- tunaziona huku daily unaenda kwa mat there are so many neza ku mention hapa most psychological illnesses that people don't even understand that illnesses utafikiria mtu tu ni pervert but um sana go through a psychological illness hebu tutajia kadha unaweza kuoka kwa ma tv alafu ile venye watu usimama kwa mata mejishikilia and then um mtu anapita ana 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 rub behind you intentionally and then you dem ana jam mm. that's an illness wo mtu ana uh, go through a sexual disorder Wala. You get eh, kuna watu utapata kuna mse utaona there is um there is one that have experienced up archives juzi na mtu alikuwa anataka kupigwa um people who go exposing their their um, ni mtu wako sen kabisa si cheesy but ana expose private parts alafu anashtua dem dem anashtuka na piga nduru watu wanasema alikuwa rapist nini yoni ugonjwa ni tua exhibitionism ku exhibit wow. that's how they get gratification you get but that's an illness but sasa ju sisi hatuna information to terms to your type to say eh umse ni rapist eh umse ni nini umse ni you get but hizo ni ugonjwa ugonjwa za akili ni more than so lakini hatuna information na bible inasema my people die due to lack of knowledge ameongeza di biblia bu 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 is don't make it while car rada Yo, I'm just starting a podcast. I would really la- like to pick your mind a little bit, but that's beyond the point. No, this doesn't make change anything. I have to make to mongelea watoto dance classes, to make mongelea wewe. Uh so tell me about dance and therapy, how those two come together. So after kukuwa msani then over the years God can give you grace, nikapata following kidogo. Yo kidogo mino elbe kidogo eh eh it's big it's big i appreciate everyone out there who found it twice to follow me people who love what we do over 2 million people on tiktok almost 200,000 on instagram it's, it's crazy how much people love what we do so maju kuna kitu inaitwa dance therapy mm. where people just have therapy in the context of dance wow maju mm. Mhm. Siku yetu. Sorry. Ni ni ni. Unajua wana sema ngi kutembea kwingi kuona mingi. Exposure is important. Yeah, so ukisema uko ni kwetu ina maanisha pia ka exposure kidogo. Yeah, so kuna kitu inaitwa music therapy. Kuna different types of therapy you get. So me being a therapist professionally, 
I was like mimi nasikia ga poa by the way mimi mimi ni ngumu sana nipate niko na stress mimi I I am never stressed yeah, okay niko na kuanga na levels of stress but nikisha ingia tu kwa zone ya ku dance it's done you get mm-hmm. and I feel it's a um, it's a feeling all of us can share because we all can move mm-hmm. you get it's mm-hmm. universal so long as hata si lazima ujue your song ni what language mm-hmm. utasikia despacito ito itrend uko mm-hmm. na tukuje kutu dance wone watu wengine waki dance ngenge ton Jamaica una get so na nika feel e space ya therapy inaweza kuwa better received by cuz Kenya biggest population is the youth mm-hmm. na tuko high tuko na energy mm-hmm. inaweza kuwa better received by the generation if we would give it in a perception that is friendly to them other than the stig- the, the normal stereotype therapy kwenye una fauka chini na therapist counselor hata wewe ndio waambie best yako you are seeing a therapist ndio taku judge I mean the judge uh, by the way so uh, una uh, get so <laughs> <laughs> so like field dance therapy ni space in high occupied nani among my goals to set up a uh, fully functional dance therapy farm where people come to na vibe and in the context of therapy and in the context of dance to naweza ku empower ourselves and become better people goal to niku kwa to better people mm-hmm. eh yeah, psychologically because it all starts from the psyche mm-hmm. kama hapa siko poa ta mtakonda mm-hmm. ama ni none excessively nianze kuongea vibaya unajua nikikongelesha vibaya na project tu vitu ziko hapa ndani so <laughs> yeah, we can just do that all that from doing dance yeah so that's that's that is what brought about dance therapy mm-hmm. so we are looking at em- employing very many therapists who would be interested because unapata kama kia youth na graduate so many of us psychologists mm-hmm undergraduate you get na cc kila mtu atapata chance ya kurudi shule kama mimi we are like five out of over say a thousand that graduated in my year mm-hmm. watu watano ndo wamerudi hii mwaka kufanya masters na wengine maybe wa wili ndio wataenda kufanya you get mm-hmm. so not all of us will have a chance to extend our studies mm-hmm. but if we would create avenues where we would create jobs for other dancers who would be interested in empowering other people and other psychologists who will be interested in empowering people in the context of dance then up to me empower what to wakapata good mental health statuses wakapata employment na Kenya ka kwa to a better place mm-hmm. basically so what i'm hearing from you is you use your platform social media or otherwise to not only teach dance but i'll call you a healer because you sound like a healer so you also can heal eventually yeah, yeah that's the goal uh-huh. that's the goal even yes sasa ni step by step alafu pia pia mimi na na, na, na supervisiwa na watu wamekuwa kwa hii industry ya dance na industry ya therapy mm-hmm. niambiwe what to step what not to touch nini nini unajua kuna hizo guidelines pia sijui kila kitu so i'm still learning as i move you remain teachable that's so cool you have to okay yeah this is me just being very very curious mm-hmm. uh this i want to be very careful with my words right now yeah. but there are people i have come into contact with i don't want to say it's a particular generation because that would be a bit far fetched mm-hmm. but the majority of nisema wasani was squeezy au people who really want to be in the limelight who are you know going after this fame and fortune i am hoping you're tying fortune also because you can be famous and not have mm-hmm. but fame and fortune so they don't really think school is important because in fact in Akanika in our with their time so that yeah. the, the faster they get into what they're doing the faster they get into their craft the the more they work on it experience versus you know um, yeah. going to a classroom and writing notes or something like that but yeah. you have chosen to go to school finish and then continue extend the way you've put it why i think knowledge is well mm-hmm. like mtu amenda shule honestly whether when ni msani unafanya kazi kwa ofisi when ni watchman when he house help mtu amenda shule reasoning yake ni totally different from mtu amenda shule purely school is not for even certificates mm-hmm. one it's for exposure because kama singenda ke you singe kwa the color blue as people know him today mm-hmm. but besides the exposure that you get from school i think school just broadens you your thinking capacity your scope and perception towards life like sita 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 passive life then nime lelewa uko ushago i'll see life in a multi dimensional 
aspect. Sita judge who yuju anataka kuwa DJ na ako na degree. Mm. You get. But to someone else who has been socialized to understanding that school is the only way, mm -hmm. ama DJing is not an ideal job, mm -hmm. will stereotype into someone who is wasting mm -hmm. time, you get. Mm -hmm. So I think school just gives you a different perception to na watu wengine. Mm -hmm. So me, me, my advice to any artist, like we all need to go to school. B besides even that, in a idea in matters, IP, like just understanding why mm -hmm. IP in intellectual property. No, ni mecheka tu then you may drop eh, casually. Like, unapata like kuna, <laughs> kuna sisi wengi, wene, wengi wetu wa sanina tujenda shule, so unapata eh. utapewa ma contract zenye zinaungia kizungu mingi. Na unasign And then to. unasign to, unapata umendo uka make deals zingine mm. mbaya mbaya, umapata umendo uka, uka harasi wa pahali, hatu wezi jitetea. Mm. Mimi okay. kama mimi kolo mi wezi ni harass. Hatu kwe president. Fine print, unasoma. No, uh, it's not even about kusoma, it's about knowing who you are. Mm -hmm. I think school ina kuwe empower to in a different. Una kuwa tu mtu tofauti by just going to school. Mm -hmm. So I'm, I'm, mimi personally, I do not work with people who have not gone to school. Okay. Yeah, like, uh, honestly, see, if you see, 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 judge, ni ile. Ni ile, as in, ukipata chance, ukipata chance. Mazi rudi shule, utasedi yoto tuwa kwa takufanya math homework at least. <laughs> Unawana tuwa zeti za hiyo? Weee! Ok, alright, ok, ok. Yeah. Alright. <clears throat> kwa nomba ni kusome the, the question of the day. Alright. Right. And I would really like to hear from you if you can. So, tunasema good morning. Mapema ndo best baiza. Do you think social media is doing more harm than good in addressing the recent waves of crime in Kenya? Oh, eh, naza kupatia a penny for my thoughts alafu tumaliza na ako. Eh, definitely. Ah, na kuna kupea Shoot. time ya kuload bana. So, no, no, I care about you. Ah, tulia. Tulia. Ah, but you know, you're very tulia leo. Okay, so I was watching ah. this this interview of, oh, oh, mwenye aliandike kitabu, what's his name? It's called On Purpose, the podcast. Na ilikuwa na Michelle Obama, she was the one who was being hosted. And then she said, Kitambo, okay, Kitambo yao, atuko same age. Yeah. Kitambo yao, mm -hmm. they only used to hear news ya village, as in around, like Nairobi, Maeneo, Nakuru, Naivasha, Ikenda Sana, maybe City of Champions, what, mm -hmm. what, what. Like, that's the news you had. And, and we're living in a world where maybe crime perhaps imeshuka. But now, tunasikia kila kitu at Every given time, every minute, we hear everything. So I know what's happening in Japan is an earthquake. I know what's happening in Sudan. I know what's happening on the Gaza Strip with Israel and Palestine. I know what's happening in Sujiwapi. Eh, nana juasai, Kenya na mehape Homa Bay, Airbnb. Like, I know everything at a blink of an eye. Yeah. So is, is social media making it worse? Because now we know everything happening everywhere. Ama, it's just a tool. You are giving us your thoughts. Oh. Yeah. For me, I think there is no generation in time yet that has had much more power than we have mm. courtesy of social media. I am in touch with what dancers are doing in Japan by virtue of social media. Mm. We are in touch with the technology that will cure cancer that's in China by virtue of social media. Tuneza mm. kujua... Um, Gaza na sju wapi kuna fight. So mamangu hata chukua job uko. Mm -hmm. Watch your social media. <coughs> so is this how we want to perceive it? Kuna watu wanasema nga genge to nichafu. Mm -hmm. na, na ngoja reaction to You get. <laughs> Kuna watu wanasema nga genge to nichafu. But genge to niko na listeners wa genge. Mm -hmm. Just as jazz music has jazz music listeners. Mm -hmm. You get. So social media has taken its place in a world that we can't kill social media. I don't think it's doable unless the internet is done and done. And if the internet is done, then tunarudi stone age. Nive tu tutakosa tu masura za homo erectus. Besides that, tutarudi stone age, then akutakuwa na haja DJ. You get, because oh. without internet, atakuwa na toa api mziki. No, atakuwa na haja TV. You get, because tutakuwa tuna detective, wa, watakuwa na dictate Kenya wanataka tusikie. Mm -hmm. But through social media, Twitter, tunaza jua Kenya Elon Musk amefanya sai, tutajua. Mm -hmm. Pop, akikufa, tunajua sai. You no, get, no, exactly. Mm -hmm. like social, for me, I think social media is doing, as much as it has its disadvantages, which is like any other thing in life, I'm not a, an entirely good person. Nobody is an entirely good person. So there is no one entity in life that will be entirely good. Mm. 
-hmm. even the church mm -hmm. it has its pros and cons like church kuna watu wanasema nga hey, kuna hizi vitu fulani zinafanywa na church zenye si poa lakini unakumbuka hiyo church ndio inatupeleka binguni like hiyo ndio yenye tatu highlight ya steps za kwenda binguni so kama hii kitu yenye Mungu alituachia bado iko na disadvantages why are we limiting social media to boundaries of our thoughts though if you two thoughts nzito lakini maambiwa time me Eh yeah, so si thani social media is that bad oh. in as equal limitations mm -hmm. but apana you kitu ina to say be away more than in to harm mm -hmm. yeah because kama sisi hatuje kuwa hapa mm -hmm. mm. thank you so very much kola um, uko na salamu nisikukose wow. ama hujatoka hiyo maeneo mimi akisimanga salamu i think mm. Hata be utaki kumsalimia. Sina. In case uko huko nje unatafuta mtu. Nice. Niko hapa walai. Oh this one atubeba. Ah natubeba tumeconfirm. Walai. Kolo kolo. Uko huko nje unasikia tu nataka tu mtu mweusi hana pesa ana struggle. It's and the most. Kita kuja usome kando yake tupime. We at Twitter yeah. for Facebook Wi-Fi for, for channel on uh, X hashtag is Social Friday where we bring your weekend on a weekday. This has been such an amazing conversation with one color blue, not wearing a blue thing in sight, but now I'm being represent leo. Alisa mai kondani, ndani, ndani, ndani. Thank you so very much. I hope to see you again, whether it's here or somewhere else. I, I really do. I get Maju. to. Maju. Tunenda. Tupata niko Hollywood uki host na uko. We we una ntokia mazuri. Aya ebu Benitez, let's go. The infusion